Good morning, everyone. It's January 8th. It's actually about 11.30 this morning. I woke up super late. I slept through my alarm, and normally I naturally wake up at around 7 anyway, and I slept in until 9. <laughs> and I was supposed to go to breakfast with Kaylee one last time before she leaves to go back to school, and so I met up with her and her friend, but I was late. Anyway, went to eat breakfast, and now I'm back. I made my bed, and actually I'm doing some laundry, so that laundry is dry, so I need to put it away, and then I've been organizing some other loads of laundry, as you can tell. Oh, I wanted to share this. Um, I actually bought the Dave Ramsey Financial Peace University thing because I want to learn more about money, like how to handle money, how to save money, how to budget money, how to invest money. I just don't know anything except for like putting money in a savings account. There's a church up here that's doing like a class on it and so you buy the little kit that comes with like the book and then the pamphlet and then all this stuff and then it's like a, I think it's like a nine or ten week course and then you just do it once a week and then you learn all the information that you need. That's pretty cool. That was kind of one of my goals for 2016 was to learn how to better manage money. Yeah, anyway, I am actually going to start editing right now and I am going to read my Bible and I got to put that laundry away. So it's been a really good morning. I'm going to read. I've been reading this every single day, my Sparkling Gems book. So today is the 8th, so I'm going to read the 8th. And then I've been reading Colossians, so I'm probably going to read more of that. my makeup or my hair today just because I don't feel like it. I feel like I've been wearing makeup a lot and I just want to keep my skin not with makeup on it all the time. Made my coffee. It looks so good and it tastes really, really good this morning. So you know it's a good morning when your coffee is good and you have a cute sign from your friend Ruth, which I will link it in the description. It is so cute, it's like my favorite part of my desk. And oh, also, I have my water. I always leave my water right here. Um, I always try to have a big thing of water with me so that I'm not dehydrated. And since I'm so tired this morning, I'm gonna add the pomegranate fizzy sticks from Arbonne. These are lifesavers. So I'm gonna pour this into my water. It makes it taste super good. And it's like, it's so good. It's not a weird, like crazy weird energy drink or anything. It's like natural energy from like green tea and stuff. So even though I kind of feel like I got a little bit of a late start, it's just after 20 12. Um, I still really want to be diligent about spending time in the Word in the morning and reading my Bible and not putting it off because I'm in a rush and I have to get started with my videos. I used to have that kind of a mentality. I'm just making small changes and recognizing those. And so the, the one thing that I do want to do though is I want to study the Word. That's the most important thing to me and sometimes I get my priorities off. So this morning because people ask me and that's why I'm sharing it with you. I love John Corson, my my top favorite pastors, number one, Chuck Smith, John Corson, Britt Merrick, and Matt Chandler. They are amazing, um, and then I have books that I really love. Um, I'm going to do blog posts about all this kind of stuff, so um, like my favorite books, I really love Timothy Keller, he's one of my favorite to read. Those are the people that I like. So this morning I'm listening to Matt Chandler. I haven't listened to him in a while and he's written one of my favorite books which is To Live as Christ to Die as Gain. I recommend it to everybody. It's amazing. It's kind of like a study through the book of Philippians. I'm listening to Matt Chandler's sermon on prayer. It's new for this year and I haven't listened to him in a while so I figured that I would listen. If you literally just type in Matt Chandler and you click on a call to prayer you can watch the sermon and there you go. And I don't know where we're reading it, but I was reading um, Colossians and then I read my little book, my gems book. And yes, as I said, I'm doing laundry. So I'm so weird when I do laundry. I actually put out all the piles so that way I have to do my laundry because it drives me nuts when it's on the floor. And that way it makes me get it done. I know it's kind of like really weird. But that's what I do. I feel like I'm just in the same spot vlogging. I hope that doesn't bother you guys. I'm honestly just really trying 
to do the best that I can to vlog as much as I can. I'm almost done actually editing my new vlog. Editing that, getting that done. I'm snacking on some berries. I've been really loving raspberries and blueberries lately. Super, super good. Got my water. And I've actually made a lot of progress on my laundry, which is amazing. I don't use the dryer, and I feel like I've said this in vlogs before, but I find that my clothes look nicer, last longer, they don't fade, and they fit better when I don't use a dryer because typically clothes will shrink a little bit anyway when you wash them and I never use hot water to wash my clothes. I only use cold water. So I'm really, really careful like with my clothing. As you can see, that's why I have things hanging up here because I like to air dry them so that they stay nice and they hold their shape and it's just something that I've always done and I can't even imagine using a dryer like it I will not so anyway I've gotten a lot of laundry done which is great really good time reading my Bible this morning I want to bring back my Bible by Bible study videos I am obsessed with this screensaver I love it if you just type in like I don't know white clock screensaver for the Mac it will come up and I'm obsessed I think it looks so cute I'm so excited I've been responding to comments for about 10-15 minutes and I just love responding to you guys. I love reading your comments. I do read them and it's like my favorite thing ever. Tiffany Fit said, oh, the fortune cookie part and that was my favorite part of the vlog. I couldn't believe what Bo's fortune cookie said. I thought it was so cute. And then Grace Bean said, I love the old keyboard typing noise too. Haha, <laughs> it's so satisfying. I thought that was so funny because I thought it was the only one. <laughs> Alexis V said, Bo looks so much like Jackson Avery from Grey's Anatomy and I totally agree he does. So I've just been responding to comments. So yes, you should leave comments on my videos making lots of progress. I took a break from working on stuff so that I could make some food. So I ate my food and I also made a smoothie, which is so good. This is the favorite smoothie in the whole world. The favorite, whatever, yeah. Almond milk, half a banana, lots of frozen blueberries, and some stevia, and a little bit of ice. And that is it, and it is amazing, and you will love it. Oh my gosh, I love the color of it too. I think it's such a cute color, and it's so good. We all went out to dinner. Cheers. What's up guys? It's January 9th. It's Saturday and actually this morning I went with Lexi to a coffee shop and we worked on just like stuff. So I actually got a lot of work done which I'm very proud of myself for. Now we're gonna go to Cody and Lexi's to hang out. We're gonna go downtown and uh, we're gonna do a little tiny bit of shopping. Maybe go get some food. It's super rainy today which is actually kind of nice. I think it's pretty outside. But Foggy, huh? Bo has on his Let God Work hat. Is that Cute. Why I huh? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Let God Work. Oh, I, it's good I know, it Congrats. looks so cute. Not only that, but. Oh, you have the shirt on too, yeah. huh? They came out with these new shirts. They are so cool. I, I really and Bo like gets them. a lot of compliments on it, yeah. And everybody always asks, like tons of guys who'll be wearing this. I even wore, wore it to that beach that one day. I have a picture on my Instagram of me wearing that hat. I kind of feel like a hipster because I just started the trend around here. Yeah, and all the guys now at the beach, they'll, they, they will wear their hats, like him and Seth and Matt and all the guys. And all the guys out in the water are like, oh man, where'd you get those hats? Those are so cool. Like everybody loves them. Plus I met a viewer this morning, so that was so fun. And we got to take a picture together. Just we're getting clear. our food. Like <laughs> so we're getting fish tacos. Fish. Yummy. One, two, Let's try it. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. It's so good. So we are in Pottery Barn right now. Lexi, I convinced Lexi to get this new <laughs> lipstick from Marc Jacobs and it is so pretty. And then I got this lipstick from Bite and I got a new, the new Marc Jacobs lipstick that I wanted. I had a gift card and I returned something so my total was $8. Hello. $8. I was like, yes. I got my robe that I've been thinking about for a week. <laughs> I, this is the comfiest thing in the world. You're gonna see me wearing it too much. Like it's just so soft. My robe is so exciting. It's the little things in life. <laughs> Are you drinking all of my stuff? Stop. Is it recording? So we decided to go to In-N-Out, which we, we've never done this, have we? Aw, it's our first time at In-N-Out <laughs> together. So I get protein style, which, you can get it wrapped in lettuce, so I got it wrapped in lettuce. Because I know a lot of people don't live in California and a lot of you don't like, you've never been to In-N-Out. 
And I like the I like the hamburger protein style. They'll wrap it in lettuce for you, and um, with extra grilled onions. And I actually don't like it animal style. I've learned I don't like the animal style. But that's what I get if you ever come to California and you want to try it. Probably eat in and out like twice a year. Like no way, like I don't need it one more. Well, once a month? And no. I actually like probably get in and out like twice a year. Like, I never come to in like Anyway, but I got some really cute stuff from Sephora. Yeah. Lexi and I had so much fun shopping. We had a fun night hanging out. We're having a good, we're having a good weekend. Yay! Bye. Okay, bye. Thank you so much for watching that vlog. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to click thumbs up and leave a comment. Let me know what you think of it. Let me know what your favorite thing to order at In-N-Out is, if you like In-N-Out. Don't forget you can subscribe to this channel if you're not subscribed already, and that will notify you of all of the new vlogs that I post so that you can hang out with me in my daily life and see my vlogs. As you can see, I'm working on some stuff in the background on my bed. But anyway, I love you guys, and I will see you in my next vlog. Bye!